anything for club. They do anything for club. Do anything for club. They do. That's a vibe. She wanna vibe. That's a vibe. It's a vibe, yeah, yeah, late night. Oh, it's a vibe. Let me slide. Welcome back to the Vibers, and if you're new, hi, my name is Lauren, what's up? Alright guys, so today I'm going to be discussing reasons why I hate your favorite YouTuber. <laughs> Feel away. Alright, I know this is like an unpopular opinion on YouTubers, and yeah, I know I'm a YouTuber, but hey, this isn't towards me, this is towards them. Them. And the reason I'm making this is because I'm sick and tired of what these YouTubers are doing nowadays. The stuff that they say, the stuff that they do, like all of that. Like why? And it started off the fake drama, the fake beef, the fake pranks, the fake challenges, the fake everything. Bro, it's like every single thing they do is fake nowadays. It's not even real anymore. It's really rare to find a real YouTuber, me, nowadays. Because, like, when they do fake drama, why do you feel the need to do fake drama and fake beef and stuff? Why? Like, now you got, now you got people, um, fans commenting on the other person's thing, talk, wishing them death, the other person wishing them death and all this stuff. Like, what? Look what you're starting. Like, I don't understand why do you do this stuff. I don't understand why people do fake pranks. When they do fake pranks, it should be so blatantly obvious big words um because that camera be right in they face and they you got the person like the camera's right there like <gasps> i didn't even know like how how it's looking right at you and then you got the camera wobbling like come on now come on now you lying right now i don't understand why do you feel need to do fake pranks and then it don't even be funny actually the fake pranks don't even be funny the fake challenges, sorry to break it to you, but they don't be staying in Walmart for 24 hours, that's illegal. <laughs> the 24 hour challenges, if it's less than 10 minutes, it ain't real, sorry to break it to you. I'm, I didn't want to be the one to tell you that, but some of these challenges are fake. Some of these pranks are fake. It's, like I said, it's very hard to find a real YouTuber nowadays because all these big YouTubers like to do fake stuff. Like, huh, why? And to get on to the next one, let me give you. Let me like, like let you know. So the video, it'd be like you like five, ten seconds in, right? All you hear is, yo, give this video a big thumbs up. And make sure you subscribe down below, yo. I'm for real. Let me be quiet so you can do it. Nah, nah, nah. Don't be keep watching it. Subscribe down and like my video. Huh? I don't even know you, Capadre. How about subscribe and like your video? I don't even know you yet. I ain't even get to, I ain't even get to 20 seconds yet. I don't even know you. Like, I hate when YouTubers do that. Like, new YouTubers, please don't do that. It really gets on my nerves. Like, like, that's why I don't do that. I wait till the end of the video, like you're supposed to, the end of the video. Because then they already watched it, they already know how they feel about you, so they're gonna subscribe or like, and like your video. Boom! I don't wanna like your video, subscribe to your video before I even get to know you. Like, huh? It just gets me pissed off. And then they be asking for a certain amount of likes. Like, um, excuse me, excuse me. I'm gonna like this video and give it the amount of likes that it gets. And you're asking for 10 million likes? I'm gonna be the. I'm probably gonna be a 30th. Calm yourself. Like, I, this is just getting me so mad. It be stressing me out. I hate when they do that. So, like, word of advice please don't be one of those YouTubers and beg for an actual one likes and if you're getting a video, wait till the end. And then, this next thing is the YouTubers, mad of these YouTubers are not their real self. And what I mean by not their real self, like, they be all hype, all, all this, all that acting all hard and all that stuff in a video but I tell you if you meet them in person they are not the same they are not the same see I'm myself I'm myself anybody any of my friends can tell you I act the same way I act in school but what I mean like say you I watch reviews on I watch videos on how people meet youtubers in real life and they mad disrespectful 
you would think, like, you would never thought that all oh, your favorite YouTubers disrespectful. They nice sex. Hell, like, some of these YouTubers just do anything. They be, they act hard. They act like they all tough talking about, oh, I'm gonna beat this person, but I'm gonna beat this person. Da -da 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 -da. But I bet you if they see my person, they ain't gonna walk, they gonna walk right past them and do nothing. Mm. Like, I hate when they do that. I hate when they try to act a different way for the camera. Don't act different. Act the same. Be yourself. Like, huh? Next one, this next topic. I just don't understand why people do it. Colorist. This colorist thing is not it, bro. You got Damien and Bianca. Freaking da um, Bianca painting her skin, dark skin, talking about my am ghetto. Huh, sis? Please explain. You got... Um, people doing their makeup a darker skin tone than they self. Why? Huh? It's like, I don't, I hate when people like discriminate, like, took down on other races, because what's the point? Like, different races and different nationalities, like, why are you doing that? What's the point? What's the point? Because it's all fun and game until you find out you like half, that that's, some of that stuff is in your blood, now what? But, you know, like, when people talk down on this race, when people like try to be this race, like you got people trying to act like they're black, like, huh? How do you act? I know, how do you act the race? They, Cause they feel like black people talk ghetto and all that stuff, we really don't. There's a lot of people that talk intelligently. intelligently. Like, <laughs> but, and then they, they feel like they, where up and down they don't that they're not doing this because they're racist they're not racist um excuse me colorist is racism um so yeah on to next because i'm is this, that topic i could be talking about it all day but it's just like i i just don't want to it's just too much for me next one is youtube couple drama okay to start it really off you if you're not in a relationship for more than a year or like you believe that you're gonna be with this person for like a really long time please don't start a youtube channel please don't start a youtube channel because i'm tired of seeing people make youtube channels and then they break up and it's like being a youtube couple is like the hardest thing it's harder than being a single a regular youtube a regular youtuber by yourself because then you gotta worry about emails talking about oh she's not even pretty enough for him you got girls talking about oh he's not cute enough for her like all that stuff like etc etc you got the girls dming dming your boyfriend boys dming your girlfriend like all that drama not it and then they cheat then sometimes they end up cheating this is what i'm saying it's really hard to be a youtube couple but then you also got the ones that break up every freaking day like, like it'd be an hour, and they already spilling all the tea on their relationship. Like, what? What are you doing that for? Talking about you don't want people in your in your business. Don't put your business on social media. It's all it's everybody's business. Once you put, once you write your little paragraph on store on your story, that's everybody's business now. Like, and then and then I hate when you got the married couples, the married couples that always be like, um. I'm single now, pit my jack. No, you're not, you're married. You can't be single while you're married. It doesn't work like that. Or um, when they make videos talking about, I did a breakup prank and it led into a real breakup, huh? You can't break up. You cannot break up in a marriage. It doesn't add up. It doesn't work like that. Uh, like, it's not even funny anymore. I hate when they do that. Like YouTube, couple dramas is so freaking annoying. And then you got them doing like big breakup pranks, um, so like for social media and stuff. Like what? And you got the ones that get mad over the truth. Why are you getting mad over the truth? Like when I mean the truth, I mean when they get exposed. Um, huh? Like you did it. Accept it. Why don't you just accept the fact that you did this? Don't get mad when you got exposed. You did it. You put yourself out there. You wanted to be big. You gotta, you gotta watch what you're doing when you're big and you're a celebrity because you get exposed for every little thing. So you need to chill. But my camera's about to die, so I'm rushing. Sorry. But 
the last but not least this goes for all every single thing that i just said when they they do anything for clout do anything for clout they do anything for clout do anything for clout they do anything for clout like clout is really one hell of a drug clout is a hell of a drug that's why she gives something because i don't understand you know there's a difference between doing it for views and doing it for clout there's a big difference doing it for views is like you're being yourself and you're trying to like entertain this like, type of people but doing it for clout you're doing stupidity and stupid stuff just to get just to get a like get a view like what it's really stupid and clout is really crazy because people will do anything for it like i said clout is one hell of a drug clout i i don't do stuff for clout. i do it for views like you would never catch me doing some stupid stuff for no clout like but clout is really it's really crazy and people do stupid stuff for it and it's like all of that stuff that i listed that's everything that they do for clout they just want to be known and i think it's really dumb that they do it but to wrap it all up that's it for this video yeah i said what i said like comment and subscribe that's how it does that's how you're supposed to do it <laughs> watch all my but follow me on all my social media check out my recent content check out my other content um yeah please let me know some of your popular opinions about your favorite of uh, these youtubers please let me know so i'm not the so i know i'm not the only one and yeah that's it for this, that's it for this video you guys and if you're not vibing with me then what are you doing bye